find sin 1710 to find this we should follow this method c here we have 1710 so now we should check 1710 lies between which two multiples of 180 what i mean is 1710 lies between 1620 and 1800 this is 180 into 9 and this is 180 into 10 between these two numbers 1710 lies next now 1710 is close to which number this is equally close to both the numbers so you select any one number let us say i select 1800 So now this should be written as eighteen hundred minus ninety. So this will become sine. In place of this, we should write this eighteen hundred minus ninety. This is your step one. Next, sine. In place of eighteen hundred, now we should write ten into one eighty minus ninety. Next, here we have one eighty, so sine is not going to change; it will remain sine, and inside we get this angle ninety. Now the question is, will we get here plus or minus? to answer that we should look at the number before 180 that is 10 and 10 is even and all the even multiples of 180 they lie in either in the first or in the fourth quadrant so now to select the quadrant we should look at this symbol here we have negative that means angle lies in the fourth quadrant and in the fourth quadrant sin is negative so we should put negative so negative sin 90 is 1 this is our answer